If you're watching this video, you're probably wondering how can note taking improve managers' performance in less than a day? My name is Jonathan Kemp. I'm a human intelligence entrepreneur and the creator of Smart Wisdom, the next generation note taking and planning technique. I've been helping people to manage knowledge in the workplace for the past 20 years. So how can something as simple as note taking, you know, that thing we did at school, not very exciting, probably can't read them anyway. Maybe you type now. How can something as seemingly as dull and boring as note taking improve manage, managers' performance in less than a day and actually give them a competitive edge against other managers. And it's really simple. And a lot of it is down to one thing, which I call percentage RTU. And I'll explain what that is a bit later on. So I was a manager for quite a long time. Um, used to go to lots of meetings, which, you know, I sort of enjoyed, you know, I'm very much a people person, but what I didn't do, and didn't, well, I did do, but I, what I didn't enjoy was taking, you know, down lots of notes. Um, and what I really didn't enjoy was taking down minutes because, you know, as a manager, I'm really busy and they're not very exciting to do and I'd leave it and then I couldn't read my notes and that had an impact on me. I did a lot of interviewing, um, did a lot of coaching one-to-one -one, and, you know, being able to manage that amount of knowledge, you know, it caused pressure. And particularly if I had to write things up afterwards, I was really busy, then I didn't want to have to go through all these notes and decipher them. And if I was doing multiple interviews, you know, it all get quite confusing. So it impacted my performance, particularly if you look over a year's period. Now, then what I did is I, I made a switch and actually this was transformational for me because I always associated, you know, writing things down with taking notes, you know, but actually then I made a switch and rather than writing down for the purpose of taking notes, I started writing down to increase my knowledge real time. That was a game changer. So rather than recording information, I was actually recording for the purpose of processing that information to create high quality knowledge that I could use real time. And I'm gonna show, show you how it works. It's unbelievably simple. So there are four key elements to creating high quality knowledge. The first I call a deep filter. So as a manager, it's crucial that I actually catch, capture information. I can't just sit and listen because the human memory, we forget things, all of us do. We can only hold a certain amount at any period in time and we forget very quickly afterwards. So sitting and listening as a manager, not an option. So then I moved to this transition of capturing information for the purpose of transforming it into knowledge, which I can use real time. So the first part is a deep filter. And this was really powerful because it meant that suddenly I wasn't recording unnecessary information. So when I go back, everything's much faster to go through. And if I do a deep filter here, uh, we need to find one quick approach to help managers improve their performance and to help increase confidence. On a deep filter, what I would do is I would probably keep find, uh, one for definite, quick, approach, help managers, I don't need that because I know I'm talking about managers, Improve, definitely, there is just a connecting word. I don't need that. Professionalism, absolutely. And to help to, again, just connecting words, increase confidence. Now, the next secret to this is deep processing. And this is what ramps up the percentage RTU. And what I mean by percentage RTU, and this is the secret, is percentage real-time understanding above a level that anyone who's taking traditional notes can do and anyone who's using a laptop can do. They can't even get close to you. And this is how it works. So we go find uh, one quick, uh, and then we go approach. And what I'm doing is I'm breaking all the knowledge up in single units and then reconnecting it. And that's the breaking up and reconnecting is the deep processing that increases the 
RTU, the real-time understanding. So we get approach, I abbreviate everything. Um, it just means it's faster to harvest the knowledge, uh, improve performance, uh, sorry, improve professionalism. So improve uh, professionalism, professionalism. And increase confidence. And I will do this at speaking speed. Um, cool. Now, I'm going to explain in a moment um, the significance of the increase in understanding. In fact, I'll do it now. So, this has been tested by cognitive neuroscientists the deep filtering and the deep processing. And there's also Another key element of using uh, this form of next generation note taking is what I call dynamic management. So creating headings, subheadings, um, creating a more logical structure, being able to make links across uh, time zones. So for linking something 45 minutes in with something that was said at five minutes in, that's what I call dynamic management. Um, and what the cognitive neuroscientists found that in a complex meeting or presentation or interview or coaching session, people's real-time understanding is 64%. Not bad, but not good either. After two weeks of switching to a next generation note-taking mindset and skill, that real-time understanding leaps to 76%. And after a year, it gets even better it goes up to 84%. And if you're dyslexic, which I am, it's even better news. We're able to increase our real-time understanding by doing this deep filtering and deep processing, the dynamic management, up to 87%. So that's 23% above all the other managers who are using traditional note-taking in whatever format. And compared with people listening, they can't even come close to us. And then the final trick to all of this is a dynamic overview. And there are three elements to this, but the crucial one is the ability to capture one hour's worth of uh, knowledge on one sheet of paper, because that gives you control. And I'll give you a couple of examples. So this was a one hour meeting, and typically, um, I'm able to capture the equivalent of one and a half, two pieces of uh, traditional paper or similarly if on a laptop on three quarters of a page. But I can utilize this real time. Um, here's another example. This was a one and a half hour presentation on one sheet. Now as a manager, I don't want to have to repeat things. I left that presentation knowing exactly what everyone said and what I needed to do with it. I didn't need to process it later. And as a busy manager, that makes a huge difference. So I hope you've got some value from this. Please, if you're a listener, the key thing is to take that knowledge externally. If you're a traditional note taker, whether pen and paper or laptop, I would recommend switching to, to next generation note taking. It's really simple. Um, you know, you don't have to go this far. You can, any form of <clears throat> deeper processing, deeper filtering is gonna make a real difference for you. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Um, please, of course, feel free to uh, share it with other managers or people who are responsible for training managers or heads of organizations which have lots of managers. Um, always feel free to pop a comment in the co comment box, um, like, and as I say, please feel free to share widely. I want to thank you very much for watching and I hope you have a superb rest of the day. And of course, on the sides, up above or down below. Um, I've put some free tips together for you and you'll find a link. Just click on the link and you'll be able to download them.